Um, the first thing that, uh, and which is major, is the high cost of agricultural uh, inputs. Um, and as a country, in terms of intervening, uh, we have uh, several programs to doing that. The first one is uh, we are implementing the farmer input uh, support uh, program. Uh, we are providing farmers with uh, seeds and uh, fertilizers, and not only just for maize, because all along from the time it was it was introduced uh, in 20. 2002, we've been more focusing on maize, but from 2009 we have refined the program and we are supporting other crops. And um, also uh, in terms of increasing um, availability of improved uh, seed, we are promoting a rural uh, seed system which encourage uh, smallholder seed multiplication. In this way, smallholder farmers um, are able to have access to improved uh, uh, inputs and also somehow related to the farmer inputs program is the food security pack which is implemented through the Ministry of uh, Community uh, Development which is uh, focusing on vulnerable but viable farmers in this same one also we are providing um, fertilizers and uh, seeds the major uh, critical issues um, is uh, issues of adoption rates to improved agricultural practices, be it inputs, practices, and the like, and uh, also inadequate extension uh, services. Because as a country right now, uh, in terms of extension worker to farmers, its uh, ratio it's about one to over one to one thousand. So one extension officer is responsible for over one thousand uh, farmers, and this is challenging because we have to make uh, these extension uh, farmers mobile they need to have operational funds and so on and uh, the, the, the districts or the camps in which they are they operate they are so vast so resources are uh, always discuss the first thing uh, that I want, if you look at uh, what we are focusing on and the principles of sustainable development, somehow they could be, the approach they could be conflicting and so on. But the major thing is issue, issue of prioritization because everything seems to be very important. But then what do you do first? Huh? How do you plan so that at least you score and at the end of the day you achieve everything? So through sharing uh, experiences, I expect um, to learn on how we are going to implement everything and in the process also um, prioritize because as a country you, know, you see there are so many needs everyone wants to be helped when you help one area the other area also be crying for resources but how best can we um, utilize our resources to achieve the intended benef benefits.